What is my favorite episode? It's always like favorite moments in episodes. Uh, was was like the most recent episode that came out? They just had this run cycle that was super funny. Oh, it was when they were watching the uh, the protesting, and the police were there. So the the main protest ended, and then the cop runs on screen. He's like, "Hey, they're protesting down the road!" And he had, they have like the funniest like arm shape <laughs> movement when they're running. And it's fun because like we we have a phone call with SPDS um, twice a week. So every week I'm like, "Oh man, I saw the episode last night." That was so funny, and they're like, oh, thanks, man, thanks a lot. <laughs> uh, favorite moment in a South Park episode. <laughs> All right, so, so my favorite uh, moment in a South Park episode, uh, it was probably, I don't know what season it was, it's somewhere around season nine, but the boys go to a, uh, the water park, like, like SeaWorld, and they meet this whale, and uh, the whale, well, the whale doesn't talk to them, but they're tricked into thinking the whale talks to them. And so all this craziness happens, and they wind up, they wind up paying the Mexican government 200 bucks to, to, to return the whale home. And at the culmination of the show, I think you have, like, like Pete has shown up to try and, like, set the whale free. The whale's owners have shown up because they want the whale back. There's this big, like, overarching story about animal rights and all this other stuff. And the boys, in the background, you see this rocket go up, up, up. Up. <laughs> they launch and the whale takes off into space. And I think I laughed for about 10 minutes after that episode was done. And, and they're playing the credits actually, and, and the whale's just sitting there on the moon, <laughs> dead. <laughs> and uh, uh, I, uh, that one always sticks in my mind as, as probably one of, the, one of the longest periods of time in my life where I just laughed uncontrollably. <laughs> and as after the show was done, I was still just giggling about this poor whale that got launched into space. I've been uh, catching up on some South Park episodes recently, and and Mint Berry Crunch is just like that. That episode was so serious, and then all of a sudden, when the father from another planet was talking to Mint Berry Crunch behind him, I was I was gone. I was laughing so hard. That was that was good. <laughs> well, the human sentai pad, you really can't beat the moment right there. That is as as far as they've really gone in that show. That's pretty funny. Ooh, uh, favorite song is the, my personal one was the Butters, There's Something in My Front Pocket for You was my favorite song. Actually. Certainly when Cartman uses his powers of invisibility to go up on stage and he, his powers of inv invisibility of course include him getting naked because if you're not wearing clothes, then you're invisible and no one can see your clothes, right? And so he's tiptoeing like stealthy-like in front of this giant crowd of adults who are all paralyzed by the sight they're seeing and there's this really long, painfully awkward shot of Cartman being all naked, stealthing across the stage. And it, it goes on for like comically too long. Um, and then of course they cut to the angry parents at the, uh, um, at the community center and they're all pissed off. And you'd think they'd be pissed off at these kids being really violent towards each other, but instead they're upset that like, you know, oh no, we saw a little boy's penis. And I think that's just a great commentary on, on American censorship. It's like, oh yeah, you can see guys rip each other's spines out and brush your teeth with, you know, the opponent's brains. Like, it, but you see a tit and suddenly it's like, oh gosh, it's the end of the world. Um, well, let's go back to the de decapitations. Let's not teach anyone how to reproduce. Let's teach them how to be violent little fuckers. <laughs> so yeah, I think that's certainly one of my favorite scenes in South Park. And I, I have no idea why I find this South Park moment so entertaining but it's the episode of the Lake Tardy Kaka, and it's where just randomly the shark comes out of the, 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 uh, come out of the lake and starts, starts <laughs> in on the kid. And I don't know why, I just find it, because it's just like this weird like segue, and then he's like, oh, and then the shark just comes in. And I don't know why I find that entertaining. It probably is saying something horrible about my character. But uh, yeah, that's, that's the one weird thing that I, I just find entertaining every time I see the episode.